you know there are a wide variety of great summer bedding plants that will provide lots of color for you in your summer flower beds. A really neat one is a summer bedding plant called Celosia, and there are three distinctive forms of Celosia. I thought I'd point those out to you today. Now this is the spicata or wheat Celosia here. You can see these sharp little spiky uh, uh, inflorescences with this beautiful flower on it. These are very heat tolerant will bloom all through the summer. These are crested Celosias or coxcomb Celosias, and they produce these wonderful crested flowers that look almost like like a brain when you look at the top of them. And then finally there are the feather celosias or plumed celosias and you see those here. Now these celosias will bloom all through the summer. As the flowers start to fade you can trim them off and deadhead them to keep them looking attractive but otherwise they really look nicely. Of the three the wheat celosia is really the strongest. This one called Intense is dwarfed. The wheat celosias in the past have been five to six feet tall. This one stays nice and short. So think about adding some of these beautiful celosias. You can add them to your gardens now. You should find them in your nurseries. The plume types, the crusted types or the wheat types all make great additions to your summer flower garden. Forget it growing. I'm Dan Gill with the LSU Ag Center.